What would you tell your younger self? You're now, you're leading a school. <sighs> You've got school done differently. You're right. impacting, how many kids are in your school? Um, we have about 45. Students. So 45 students, you're changing their lives. Mm -hmm. You're touching the parents. The parents mm -hmm. are involved in this community. Right. What would you tell your younger self? Don't quit. <laughs> at at the you know there have been times when you know when I was in that, when I was in college I um I almost quit and quit life you know um in total and so there there are times when um I would definitely look at her and remind her that someone is out there waiting on you to be great and so I tell well, my kids this, again. <laughs> someone is waiting on you to be great um I tell my kids this all the time when they come in my office and they're just you know I can't do this. I can't, you know, I'm at the end. I'm at the end. I remind them that, you know, someone is waiting on you to get to the place that you're supposed to be. And I, and I tell them, you know, mm -hmm. there was a time when I almost quit and I almost gave up and I was at a, I was at a conference and I was crying and sad. And this lady came up to me and she hugged me and she said, I, God told me to come and tell you that the thing that you're going through right now isn't even for you. And so much so that someone is coming behind you that's going to need to know that you, that, that you made it so that they made it, so they can then make it through the process. I think that we're not honest enough mm -hmm. about how natural it is to feel like giving up right. and to get at that last point where we even question our significance on the planet. <sighs> I think most of us, I certainly right. have had many moments like right. that. And I think especially when you define yourself by your performance mm -hmm. and your performance doesn't come out it good, mm -hmm. how do you live with being so messy or such a failure or having so much loss around right, you? Right, right. But we have to separate our performance from who we are Absolutely. and understand that we have this purpose, Absolutely. right? But for other people to hear, I've had a moment where I just felt like there's no reason for me living. For you to say, I've had a moment where mm -hmm. I felt like giving up and not doing and looking at the impact Mm -hmm. you're stewarding now mm -hmm. we all have to remember that there's a mighty battle going on in everyone's in every life, one of us right in everyone else and it's like good it's like the light force and the dark force mm -hmm. want us to give up i believe that right 